Welcome to our video on effective conflict management and group decision making. In this video, we will explore the key concepts of conflict management, negotiation, group dynamics, and decision making within groups. Let's dive in. In this section, we will explore the psychology behind conflict and its impact on group dynamics. We will delve into different types of conflict, including intrapersonal, interpersonal, intergroup, and intergroup conflicts. Additionally, we will discuss negotiation skills and conflict resolution strategies for effective group decision making. Conflict can arise from differences in values, goals, communication styles, and personalities. It can also stem from competition for resources, power dynamics, and unresolved past issues. Understanding these sources of conflict is crucial for effective conflict management within groups. In conflict management, effective strategies for resolving conflicts include open communication, active listening, empathy, negotiation, and compromise. It is important to set clear boundaries, practice self-awareness, and be willing to apologize and forgive. Seeking support from others and reflecting on the situation can also be helpful. Conflict within a group can have a significant impact on its dynamics. It can disrupt harmony, create tension, and lead to mistrust and breakdown in communication. Additionally, it may result in divisions and factions within the group, undermining collective goals and productivity. Unresolved conflict can lead to a toxic work environment, affecting morale and overall team performance. On the other hand, effectively managed conflict can lead to increased understanding, collaboration, and innovation within the group. Effective negotiation involves thorough preparation, including understanding our own positions and the interests of the other party. It also requires active listening and empathy to comprehend the other party's perspective. Adaptability is crucial for responding to changing circumstances, and the focus should be on finding common ground for a mutually beneficial outcome. In negotiation, it's important to practice active listening, empathy, and interest-based negotiation. Role clarification, prompt intervention, and mediation can also be effective tactics. Clear communication and understanding of human dynamics are crucial, as is a commitment to finding a solution aligned with organizational goals. Negotiation in group settings is about finding common ground and reaching a mutually beneficial agreement. It involves active listening, empathy, and navigating conflicting interests within the group. Understanding organizational culture and adapting to context and culture nuances are crucial. The goal is for both parties to exit with a sense of accomplishment and collaborative needs met. Group dynamics play a crucial role in influencing group behavior. Factors such as group cohesion, conflict, decision-making processes, and group roles and norms all contribute to shaping the dynamics within a group. These elements can impact how conflicts are managed and decisions are made within the group. In the context of group dynamics, team cohesion and collaboration are essential for achieving a common goal. Effective communication, mutual support, and fostering a culture of collaboration are key elements in promoting a cohesive and productive team environment. In the context of managing conflicts within groups, it is essential to have a comprehensive understanding of human dynamics. Clear communication and open dialogue play a crucial role in addressing conflicts effectively. Strategic conflict resolution techniques and role clarification are also important for maintaining a harmonious group dynamic. When it comes to group decision-making processes, it involves balancing individual perspectives and collective goals. This requires active listening, negotiation, and understanding of group dynamics. Techniques like structured brainstorming and decision matrices can facilitate effective interactions. In group decision-making, there are several challenges that can impact the process. Cognitive biases can lead to irrational judgment, social loafing can result in decreased effort, and groupthink can hinder critical analysis. It's important to be aware of these challenges and implement strategies to mitigate their impact on the decision-making process. In order to improve group decision-making, there are several strategies that can be employed. Structured brainstorming encourages independent idea contribution, 
allowing for a wide range of perspectives to be considered. Decision matrices provide a systematic way to evaluate options based on criteria and weights, helping to make more informed decisions. Blind voting allows for unbiased expression of preferences, ensuring that individual biases do not influence the decision-making process. Facilitation techniques, such as establishing ground rules and active listening, can help to ensure that all voices are heard and considered in the decision-making process. In this section, we will summarize the key content discussed, including understanding conflict, the impact of organizational culture, group dynamics, facilitation techniques, psychological barriers to group decisions, and conflict in personal relationships. These topics cover conflict understanding, strategies for managing conflict, and the role of communication, group roles, and attachment styles in conflict resolution. In business scenarios, conflict resolution is essential for managing disputes between team members, departments, or external partners. Negotiation skills play a vital role in reaching agreements, making deals, and resolving conflicts within a business setting. Additionally, understanding and managing